Hi everyone, we're on step 11 today and I will be talking about essential oils for livestock. Uh, so to get started, uh, the first two animals you really do not need to be worrying about is cows and horses because they will be similar in what you are able to use in terms of essential oils. So basically however much that you would use is the same amount that they would use. Um, goats and sheep are going to be similar to dogs and chickens and ducks are going to be similar to birds. There are actually many great books out there on the subject, but we will just cover the basics in this post, right here in this video. So out in the farmyard, you will have trouble with lots of flies and mosquitoes, as you know, going on the pigs, going on the goats, going on the horses, going on the cows. And we actually have a natural insect spray recipe that is really good for this. And all you need to make this is one cup of distilled water. Um, you need one cup of apple cider vinegar, and then 25 drops of the repellent blend essential oil, which is better known as Terra Shield. When you make this, do not leave it outside. Keep it at room temperature and mix and keep in a glass bottle. Uh, you wanna make sure that you shake it before you spray it, and you will need to spray every one to two days or as much as needed. Um, have you guys ever heard of a temperamental goat. Um, if you have, try some drops of lavender around the sleeping area, in the stall, or on the muzzle. This oil can also help with respiratory issues. This is also really good for that. If you ever need to clean something, for example, a chicken coop in this case, um, a make it all natural cleaner with lemon essential oil. And to make this, all you need is eight ounces of water, you need eight ounces of white vinegar, and then you will need 30 drops of the lemon essential oil. And this is really good for, um, like I said, chicken coops, or you can clean whatever, any other um, shed or, you know, stall that the animals have, horse stall, whatever, you know. So we also have a great recipe for all animals in the home and on the farm. It is called an all-natural wound ointment. Uh, for this, you need a four-ounce mason jar, this mason jar actually has up to 12 ounces, and it has four, eight, 12 on the measurements, the different measurements. And so eight ounces of, I'm sorry, four ounces of water, and then four ounces of solid coconut oil here. And then you'll need 15 drops of the lavender essential oil, and then 15 drops of frankincense. To, to, to make this, just get a container, like a nice size bowl, melt the coconut oil, and add the essential oils in it, and mix. You have to allow it to harden and then you're ready to use it. If you do happen to leave it in a warm area, it will liquefy. So use a you know wooden craft stick, popsicle stick to apply. And I have another question for you guys. So do you know of anyone that can use any of these recipes? If they own a farm or own land, do you guys happen to know any recipes that will help them? Please comment below and like this video. Also subscribe to the channel to get a lot more information on these essential oils and how you can use them for your pets. And I'll see you guys in the next step, which is step 12. Bye.